Hey guys, uh, Timo Chmedov and the Petit Jeff is here again and I'm gonna show you today the second part of the, our mind to muscle connection uh, video about the back and it's, that's gonna include as promised the white uh, cable pull down exercise and the standing uh, cable row exercise uh, so if you didn't see the uh, part one of our video I strongly recommend to have a look uh, so you know what we're talking about, what we try to teach you uh, and so you uh, understand uh, all concept of uh, the, this video. Uh, so if you didn't see the part one, see the part one first. Uh, for the ones who already saw the part one, here's the part two. Enjoy! Perform three sets of 12 reps with a triple weight drop on the last set as we've done on the previous exercises. Remember keep your back straight and not leaning backwards while pulling the bar down. Try to keep the uh, contraction in your lats uh, from the beginning of the positive phase when you engage your lats by pushing your shoulders down and uh, till the finishing uh, with the full stretch in negative phase. Now while keeping your upper back straight, slide out further back uh, on the seat so when you pull the cable down and keeping the bar a couple inches in front of your body uh, the bar moves vertically down and not in an angle. Keep overhand grip just outside shoulder width uh, with your thumbs over. Elbows uh, move slightly forward. Again, it's uh, highly advisable to use the straps uh, for the, uh, on this exercise for the same reason as previous ones. Uh, so you can focus more on engaging and contracting your back muscles instead of uh, focusing on your grip. Uh, grab the bar and stretch all the way up, rolling your shoulders up as well. Uh, from the top position, uh, push your shoulders down without bending your arms. Try to hold this contraction for the moment, uh, then release uh, to the full stretch again. Uh, this way you're able to contract and engage your lats uh, from the very beginning of the motion. And if you don't do that, uh, there is a big chance that you start pulling uh, with your arms and your arms will be doing the most of the work instead of your back. Uh, keep repeating this contract release uh, motion as many times as you need to feel it. Uh, now exactly the same technique you're gonna use uh, for the cable pull down exercise on every sing single repetition. Uh, stretch your way up, uh, push your shoulders down, engage your lats and pull the bar uh, by driving the elbows down. Remember to keep the bar a couple inches in front of your body during the range of movement elbow slightly forward uh, that will help you to concentrate on your lats isolation better uh, all exercises performed again in very slow tempo as the previous ones uh, trying to contract your lats as hard as you can during the whole range of movement in both negative and uh, positive phases uh, the working weight again is very light light enough to do 20-25 reps in normal manner uh, usually I wouldn't recommend to stretch fully and this uh, exercise because you are losing contraction in the muscle and you're reducing uh, the time under contraction uh, during the exercise and the range of movement uh, but in this exact example uh, what I want you to, to, to learn is to learn to efficiently uh, contract the muscle from relaxed state or semi-relaxed state uh, so you can efficiently to contract it in the beginning of the motion and keep it contracting during the whole range of the motion. Uh, so to learn that, you have to uh, repeatedly relax and contract the muscle, so you can feel, uh, so you can learn that feeling and learn that uh, 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 movement uh, of the contracting it and relaxing it. When when you're good in this, uh, you're gonna do it like on a subconscious level, and the the movement is gonna be much smoother and from the side it's not going to be visible to untrained eyes so you're actually engaging your lats in the beginning but you're going to feel a, a great difference in doing that our next and last exercise in this video is a standing cable row uh, we will perform uh, it for three sets uh, 20 reps each uh, with the 10 reps from a standing straight position and the 10 reps from uh, slightly leaning forward position uh, by this time you should feel uh, sore and pumped in your lats and uh, uh, pretty tired also uh, so we're not using the same very slow tempo 
uh, but we're doing it a little bit quicker, around 3 seconds on positive and 3 seconds on negative phases. Uh, so here I want you to keep uh, your lats contracted at all time during all range of movement and uh, not relax them on the full stretch. Uh, in the end of the positive phase, on the bottom of the range, uh, squeeze your lats as hard as you can uh, and still keep them contracted uh, during all negative phase while releasing the bar. Uh, do the 10 reps uh, in this way and then lean forward about 45 degree and uh, uh, continue to do another 10 reps in the same manner. Uh, the weight should be light enough uh, so you can perform all 20 reps uh, but heavy enough that you feel close to the failure towards the end of the set. So guys, uh, that's it for this video today. I uh, hope you enjoyed it. I hope uh, it's gonna make a big difference uh, for your future training. Uh, we'll try to show you and explain you as much as we can, as best as we can uh, so it won't get uh, too boring to watch it. Uh, much more videos coming soon with uh, different kind of workouts and uh, from the same series as well, the mind to uh, muscle connection. Uh, please like and share our videos, uh, subscribe to our YouTube channel. If you got any questions, uh, you can see the contact details on the bottom of the screen. Uh, so good luck and I see you soon. Timur Chmedov and Petit Jeff is out.